Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the channel for another meal prep tip video. Today we are making the world's greatest tuna salad recipe. Because let's face it, tuna salad can get pretty bland at times and tuna is really just a boring, boring canned meat. But we're gonna spice things up here today. This recipe is going to yield six servings. Each serving is gonna be 297 calories, 9.3 grams of fat, 19.3 grams of carbs, and a whopping 34.4 grams of protein. To get things going, we are going to drain and empty four cans of solid white tuna into a Tupperware. We're gonna go ahead and add half a cup of minced red onion, one and a half celery stalks, which I have minced as well, four large pitted medjool dates, which I have minced as well. You don't have to use dates. You can also swap these out for grapes or cube pineapple. We're gonna go ahead and cut one whole lemon and squeeze the lemon juice into our container. Following this, we're going to add about a half tablespoon of dill weed instead of pickle relish. Half a tablespoon of ground black pepper. About half a teaspoon of sea salt or whatever kind of salt you have available. At this point, we are going to be adding our wet ingredients. So right here, I'm adding eight tablespoons of olive oil mayo. This is more of a personal preference, so if you want a creamier tuna salad, go ahead and add more. If you don't like a whole lot of mayo in your tuna salad, then feel free to add less. Moving on, we're gonna be adding one and a half tablespoon of mustard. Right here, I am using spicy brown, but feel free to use yellow or whatever flavor you like. After that, we're gonna use one tablespoon of sriracha hot sauce. You can put more if you want it spicier. This really just for flavor. Once you have all your ingredients combined, go ahead and give it a very thorough mix through. You want all those flavors and ingredients to really mesh together and coat all of our tuna salad. This is gonna allow us to have a balanced flavor in every single bite. Once you are done, you can serve this up on a bed of salad greens or on a sandwich, which is typically how I like to eat mine. I typically will eat my tuna salad on a sandwich with a side of fruit and maybe some low carb chips. That's gonna wrap up our world's greatest tuna salad recipe. If you're brand new to the channel, go ahead and hit subscribe, drop a like on the video, I really do appreciate it. And as always, eat healthy, stay happy. I'll see you guys next time.